I felt very comfortable. That was a great feeling, like leaving the stadium after a tough spring and having a game like that truly like made me happy. Jordan Travis is happy for good reason. In his first game action inside Dope Campbell Stadium, the freshman felt right at home, completing 22 of 28 passes for 241 yards. Developed a lot, you know, coming in, having to learn a new offense, a uh, new team in general, you know, um, every, everybody's took him. Everybody's took him in, and um, he's one of us now. Um, the work he's been putting in, everybody's noticing it, and he's been making plays, as you can see in the spring game. So uh, Jordan Travis is working, and uh, everybody sees it. Travis is no stranger to Florida State, spending many a weekend on campus in an iconic stadium, just not Dope Campbell, as he grew up watching his older brother, Devin, play baseball at Dick Hauser. I just remember every Friday uh, leaving school early, driving six hours up here uh, every single weekend, and watching him play was awesome. Like Just to see him succeed is like a great failing for me. It feels good to play a different sport than him, so like I don't have to do exactly what he did nor better. I kind of can do my own thing and focus on football. That focus has been on display this spring as the dual threat quarterback has seen great improvement from practice one to the spring game. I just feel like I got a lot more comfortable. The guys truly welcomed me in and like accepted me. Every single day at practice, they pushed me to get better and just said, if you're gonna get there, you're gonna get there. And eventually I got together and I got my stuff right. Um, he came in comfortable. Um, everyone loves him around here. Um, we just welcome him in as a family member. He's been doing a great job of just coming to work, coming to work, and putting in the work, and learning the offense, and learning the guys around him, getting to understand the guys around him. And I feel like he's just been put in a great situation. Now Travis and the rest of the Seminoles will set their focus on summer workouts, hoping to keep making progress towards the 2019 season. Lane Hurt Seminoles.com.